Some of us maybe have been putting Some. on a couple of pounds during the pandemic. Yep. Others <laughs> who are crazy. Better than us. Are better than uh, us. You've been you, biking a lot. I've been biking a lot, yeah. but I've been eat, eating a lot. <laughs> All right. A little stress eating maybe. I don't know. Oh, no. There's a new survey out from United Healthcare. It shows that two-thirds of Americans say they love to walk. That's the kind of exercise that they've been doing. It's their preferred way sure. since the start of the pandemic. This is, should not be a shock to anybody. I mean, you go outside. <laughs> I mean, that it's literally at, what is everybody's doing. Let's go for a walk. Right. Because there's not... Even early on, there wasn't much else you could do. <laughs> yeah. I mean, uh, yeah, I walk or run. I mean, really, that's kind of thing. I do that with my kids all the time. I mean, it's like we're walking around the block, you know, or, you know, headed to a park area or just kind of running around. But a lot of people are out getting the, getting the steps in for sure. Well, what were the choices on this survey? So if you're going to ask Americans who in general do not really want to exercise at all, like, what are your choices? What's your top one? Walking or sitting yeah. on the couch? <laughs> I mean, walking. Does it count? We'll walk. Is walking. It's walking. It is true. My wife and I, especially in the early days of this, we were taking walks around the neighborhood. You know, now we're a good five months into this. We're sick of each other. Like, we don't want to go walk around the neighborhood. We don't need that. No. Change the scenery. Go by a lake. Walk right. around a lake. See if that helps. Right. I mean, I know every inch of my subdivision in Maple Grove now, and some of you have been doing a great job. You know, and that means you need to get out of the Maple landscaping. Grove. You looks need to good. come well, down here. You need to maybe come in, nope. in my neighborhood and hang out. Or, maybe, you know, yeah. Same. Well, for me, it's been biking for sure. Yeah. It's been what I've yeah. uh, been doing during this. How about you, Heather? Yeah. Yeah, You're a runner I'm, naturally. I'm a runner naturally, so this has been great for me because it's, it's, I mean, the summertime is the best time of year where you can just get outside and it's uh, early when it's light out. Mm -hmm. uh, it's, it's just been, it's been great. And, uh, you know, my fear is though, once it starts getting cold again and the, the hours get shorter again, and we're still, if we're still in this pandemic, we, we're still in this pandemic that people aren't going to be able to get outside as much. Um, mm, so, you know, sure. we'll keep the walking up, bring on your, uh, sweatshirts and your hats and your jackets. Uh, we want to know your feedback. What do you think? Have you been walking more since the start of the pandemic? And let us know. Jason needs a new spot to walk. What's your favorite place to go? <laughs> we'll send him over there. WCCO.com slash Facebook or comment to us on Twitter. Andrew says definitely walking more. I like walking at Quarry Park near St. Cloud. Nice. That's a great park, too. Mm -hmm. Allie says it actually makes me happy to see people walking around the city suburbs with their kids and dogs. One good thing about this horrible pandemic. It's true. Julie says she's been walking around the city lakes. I've made several trips around each of them. Nice. Yep. Thanks, everybody, for your mm -hmm. feedback.